there, it's J Dog. Hey, this video is of a campground in Colorado. And the campground is the Chuck Lake Campground, which is a U.S. Forest Service campground that's located in the uh, Saywatch Mountain Range. And what you're looking at here is uh, I'm driving on Country Road 162 right outside of Buena Vista, Colorado. Uh, this uh, campground is located up in that mountain range. It's a beautiful little spot uh, at uh, 8,700 feet. And what I'm going to show you here in this video is just uh, what that place looks like. I hope you enjoy it. This is J-Dog. Welcome to my vlog. I thought I'd today do a little uh, video on a campground we're staying at uh, up in Colorado. We're at the Chalk Lake Campground. This is a U.S. Uh, Forest Service campground uh, near Mount Princeton. It's uh, about uh, 30 miles north of uh, Salida. And this is one of, one of the loveliest campgrounds I've ever stayed at. Uh, it's kind of out in the middle of nowhere, tucked uh, in the mountains, and I'll show you here uh, uh, what you'll be able to see here. But uh, it's a small little campground. It's got about 18 sites and um, no facilities really. It's got a water spigot and trash and vault toilets, but that's it. But the views are priceless. It's one of the most, it's the prettiest place I've ever stayed. It rivals uh, Rocky Mountain National Park. Um, just spectacular. So. I want to show you some other video clips here and some stills, so uh, stay tuned. I'm going to pan here and show you uh, what some of this uh, scenery is like here that you can see. these are uh, This campground is kind of tucked in a little valley. Uh, this valley kind of goes up right to the Continental Divide. We're at 8,700 feet and uh, the mountains are just intoxicating to look at. Uh, it's, this time of year, it's June 1st as I'm shooting this, and uh, things are starting to green up. That's my camper in the uh, foreground. But uh, if you keep going uh, through that little V-notch there, you go up to the little town of St. Elmo and Tin Cup. Uh, it's a dirt road to get over the Continental Divide. Uh, but we're not going there today. Uh, we're going to head back down to Mount Princeton and uh, go up to Leadville. But, uh, Try to show you what, what uh, this scenery is like, real slowly. I believe that's Mount Princeton up there, the snow-covered uh, uh, mountain you see. But uh, pretty spectacular. View of Mount Princeton. There's actually a waterfall up there, as you can see, right above the tree line. It's probably tough to make out in this video. But there's a waterfall called Agnes... Uh, Valley Falls. It's named for a naturalist uh, from Denver and uh, that waterfall is running down there. You can hike up into it but uh, this time of year they have, they recommend you don't because of uh, kind of flash floods that can happen as the snow is coming off and you get storms here in the uh, in the springtime uh, thunderstorms but uh, this is just a gorgeous place uh, to stay. You're going to see my camper is going to come uh, into view there so you can see where we camped last night and uh, we just spent most of the afternoon just uh, staring up at the mountains. Uh, so beautiful. Creek that runs down through here. Uh, this creek runs uh, all the way down into the Arkansas River out of here. But uh, not that big of a creek. It does flow past the Mount Princeton Hot Springs. Um, but some of the campsites are right along this creek and you listen to this babbling uh, creek all, for, all night long the kiosk as you enter the campground has fees and information about the area. Uh, there's a camp host here. He's right down there on the first site. See his uh, pickup truck and uh, canopy. But uh, it costs 20 bucks a night to stay here. It's only 18 sites but it's a popular spot. Uh, I made my reservations uh, in six months ago to stay here 
campground was full last night on a on a Tuesday night here on uh, June 1st. So, but uh, that's uh, Chalk Lake, one of the prettiest places I think uh, exists in Colorado. Mm -hmm.